Housed in a vast cavern a hundred meters beneath the French-Swiss border is the most powerful particle accelerator ever built. The Large Hadron Collider will create conditions not seen since the first billionth of a second after the Big Bang at the dawn of creation. It's the biggest scientific project ever. Lynn Evans is the LHC project leader at CERN, the European Organization for Nuclear Research. Two beams of protons, one of the building blocks of matter, will circulate in opposite directions around the underground ring at close to the speed of light. The subatomic particles will be smashed together in four huge detectors placed along the 27-kilometer ring, generating showers of energy and matter. Physicists hope those will include the elusive Higgs boson, dubbed the God particle. According to the standard model of physics, this ghostly particle created in the moment following the Big Bang is responsible for assigning mass to elementary particles. But its existence is yet to be confirmed experimentally. The hunt for the Higgs isn't the only objective. One very important question is the missing mass of the universe. Uh, we, we, we now know that we can see only 4% of our universe. 96% is a complete mystery to us today. Dark matter and dark energy are two of the most vexing problems in science today. Together they dominate the universe, but nobody knows what either is. Dark energy, for example, is believed to be the hidden force that's stretching space and speeding the expansion of the universe. Some scientists believe that microscopic black holes might be generated in the collider, those cosmic hoovers from which nothing can escape. That idea has alarmed many. Critics say the $9 billion atom smasher is a doomsday machine that could destroy the planet. A group of scientists are mounting a last-minute court challenge to prevent the end of the world as we know it. Physicists at CERN insist the LHC is absolutely safe. They say that protons regularly collide in the Earth's upper atmosphere without creating black holes. Only time will tell if they're right, of course. The first particle collisions are due to take place within a few weeks, allowing scientists to probe the origins of creation as never before. Helen Long, Reuters.